Good evening, everybody. Hope you've had a good day. Uh, lots going on today. We had a chapel, closing chapel that we recorded today. Uh, lots of good stuff happening there. Uh, we did have a funeral today too, and uh, which got me thinking of the theme for tonight's uh, prayer, which is uh, stories that we remember. Uh, you know, at a funeral, one of the things we do and one of the things that happens as, as a loved one passes away uh, is to remember uh, the, the, the stories that we have of them. And uh, it brings uh, joy to us, can bring tears to us, of course, in those moments uh, as we remember them. Um, and, and part of what I talked about was the remembering, of course, the story of God's love for us uh, as shown in Jesus. And uh, what I want us to think about tonight, of course, along with that story, uh, is what are some of your favorite Bible stories? One of those things that you do that are comforting to you, uh, that, that bring uh, that story of, of God's love to, to you, especially as you go, uh, as you seek comfort in God's word. Uh, we're going through one of the stories of the main characters right now, Joseph, uh, in our Sunday sermons. Uh, and uh, as that story comes to an end, uh, in chapter 50, one of my favorite phrases will be coming from there. And, uh, and so I hope you stick with us on that and see what those things are. But uh, Joseph's story, a wonderful example of God's uh, plans and, uh, and sticking with us <clears throat> through uh, good and bad. And to see how, uh, regardless of what happens, we can continue to, to trust in him. So anyway, share in the comments tonight uh, some of your favorite Bible stories or a favorite, favorite Bible story. Uh, as you as you share those things and as you uh, as you reflect on that tonight, uh, God's blessings to you. Let's pray, Heavenly Father. We thank you today for the promise of life that we have in your Son Jesus. And Lord, help us remember, uh, as we shared today, uh, that that death has lost, that that Christ has been victorious as He is uh, uh, risen from the grave and. Uh, lives and reigns to all eternity and that we've been joined to him through that victory so christ's victory is our victory uh, lord and, and the bible points to that victory and to the promises that you've given us throughout uh, and lord I, I pray that you would continue to strengthen us with each of those stories as it reminds us of your love and the uh, the care that you have shown us uh, and the victory uh, ultimately that we have over the over sin and death in this world continue to strengthen us in your word lord help uh, help all that comfort us in this time as we think of those who are sick May it strengthen those who continue to work to serve others. Uh, and may it especially give comfort to those families that grieve. In Jesus' name, amen. God's blessings to you. Have a good night, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.